Thin film technologies are really ways to deposit an alloy with specific elements onto a substrate. And the main way to create these thin films is really with vacuum chambers. What we try to do in my lab is to replace these very costly and labor-intensive techniques with cheaper methods using molecular inks that contains already all the chemical elements. We can formulate and create this ink directly in the glove box and we can essentially print or spray these inks onto a substrate. We don't need a vacuum chamber for this. We don't need high power, we don't need vacuum pumps. This type of approach allows us to study new materials that simply cannot be deposited with vacuum techniques, either because they are not compatible in a vacuum chamber or they just require very high temperature to be evaporated we work with Stanford University, the University of Levada, NREL, as well as Lawrence Livermore National Laboratory. And all these partners really provide knowledge and have capabilities that we don't necessarily have in Hawaii to do advanced theoretical calculations or to use synchrotron equipments to really probe the atomistic properties of our materials. So it's really through the collaboration that we actually flourish and expand our research here in Hawaii. The idea is not just to make films, it's to try to drive our research through theoretical prediction, include very advanced analytical methods to try to probe the properties of the material that we create and try to come back with a method to accelerate the development of these materials.